What's happening people and welcome back to another video. Now today we have quite a different one. So for the first time ever I'm going to do a video where I revisit a live set that I've already seen. Well that might sound a bit, you know, not too appealing because why do the same reaction again? But I figured that this is something that I definitely want to do and it's like a, a new type of video idea even though it's kind of reusing stuff but like there are some sets out there that I could watch a hundred times over, and I'm sure it's the same for you guys as well. I mean, with music, like, you listen to music, the same songs, over and over. So, why not watch, like, live sets over and over? I don't see a problem with it, personally. So, maybe this is something that I will do going forward, but this set right here, my friends, was the first ever live set that I seen, that I witnessed with my very own eyes. And it was the first ever reaction video I did to this sort of music. It was the Seth set from DEFCON 1 2019. And to this day, I would say that this set is, is still my favourite. And I've seen a lot of live sets by now, you know. But this one just, oh, it's so unbelievably good. And anytime I do revisit it, it always just still gets me so hyped. So this reaction, I can tell, is going to be fucking pumping, you know? Now it is going to be drops only because I didn't want to do, like, watch the whole set again for a video because that is, like, doing the same video, I guess. But when it's drops only, it's a different way twist to it, you know? It's non-stop action. Obviously, I don't really do drops only anymore, as you may know. But for this sort of thing, I might do drops only because, yeah, I don't think I would want to do the whole set for a reaction. So without further ado, let's get into this. It's gonna be a non-stop rave for about nine minutes, so I hope you're ready. Here we go. I have returned to the greatest set in all of mankind. Oh, my knees. The knees. Ah. Oh. The nostalgia. My first ever reaction was on this set. That is insane. The fact that Seth was the first artist that I discovered was a bit mental, but I am very glad that, that that's the way it went, you know? I still remember just being in complete shock at hearing this sort of stuff for the first time. And now it's just so good, like I, I just love it. Give it up for Frenchcore tried is just such an amazing genre in my opinion. The speed of it, the sound of it, it's so fucking good. Here we go. The first ever drop was on that I heard. Old school. Oh! And as well. So, so good. This track is elite. Elite tier, my friends. Oh, no. Domination. Oh, no. Devastation. Oh! Domination. Devastation. <laughs> Domination. 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 Devastation. <laughs> Domination. Oh! That's the first, like, harmonic draw of the set. And we're so far into it already. 
That's a nice point to relax on. Oh. Not live out of loop. That was fucking outrageous. Oh, release the Kraken. That drop is one of a kind right there. Just the way that sounds is so, so different to any other drop. That's a very nice one, you know. I would say that's pretty relaxing, all things considered. Oh. Everything about this set is just still getting me so fucking excited. It's not gonna get old ever. Oh! Nah, the way that sounds is more of a kind, that's for sure. Oh! That is a masterpiece, my friend. That is so good. It's so popular. It's like, like 3 mil views or something. Ooh. Ooh. My arms are getting tired here. Oh, that's so satisfying. Going under. <laughs> Name machine coming in now. Bit of active rage through in there. Why not? Oh dear. Yeah. Walking in the air. <laughs> that is the one. That I think gives me goosebumps the most. Yeah. Makes, makes the creator of this video fly like that's just it's so fucking good. Oh. See what I mean? The way this is just so non-stop, especially with all filming. Oh. I see those type of drops that Seth does. They're like so. So it like intense, so brutal. Ooh. That's a very nice one, very peaceful. My legs are sweating as well. Oh, this one is just like emotional world of the dream. Like it's just so, so inspirational. Gives you a really good feel on that one. Up until your hands just right now. What's this? Holy shit. That drop, the monster remix, is one of the most satisfying things apart from Zephyr. She's Alice the problem! Oh, this song to this day. I've listened to this so much, but to this day, it's one of my favorites still. No, oh. that's an OG one right there. That still holds on to this day. Oh, I'm really starting to feel the pain from this. Oh, we can't move. Oh. No way. No, oh, that is fucking legendary, my friends. The fireworks and all, like, that is a perfect track to sort of wrap this up with. Is that how it ends? Yeah. Oh, this one, yeah. The anthem, of course he could do the set without the anthem, like. What a night that must have been. Like, seriously, that would have been such an experience. And then, like, as I was saying, with Get A Crack in there, when that hit and the fireworks went off, if I was there, I'd be tearing up. But nevertheless, that was it for my reaction, so hopefully you guys have enjoyed this one, and if you did, 
then make sure you drop a like on the video for me. Subscribe if you're new. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. I am flipping done.